I am Jim Moore. We're testing a fork that uh, just came out of heat treat and polish. It's a, uh, I call it a uh, replacement fork for hawk or hawk replacement fork. The only difference is the uh, thickness of the walls is two millimeters and the original hawks were one and a half. So uh, just to give it a little extra safety factor. I've already tested this fork once. And what's happening is the steer tube is bending, not the fork, apparently. So I'm going to do it again. I'm going to take a measurement right here to this axle. And this is how we tell if it's yielding. This fork will not snap off. This is uh, not like carbon fiber. So that's 38 inches right on the nose. I'm going to go push on the end of this lever, which is a little over 3 to 1. And uh, with 160 pounds of force, which will put well over 400 pounds on the fork. And more like almost 500, if you count the weight of the wood here. So you can see I got up to 160. We'll call it 150, just to be safe. And we will take another measurement here on the fork. 38 inches, so what's happened is the steerer tube has stopped bending. And we have another video where it shows a square put here, and you can see clearly that the steerer tube has bent. And the fork, these ripples here are from the forming operation. They are not from any kind of buckling or anything. And so uh, the fork appears to have survived a 500 pound load when the uh, 